All right, guys, this is going to be one of my most special videos on block shoots. Because as you know, I'm trying to become the best, the strongest alive in block shoots. And as you know, we've literally mastered and tested out every single fruit in the entire game. And most of them I have permanent. Okay, like literally like 95%. And also we're doing the swords now, but we're only missing like a few swords. One of them being the strongest sword in the entire game, which I have not done before. And this sword has a special puzzle. Now, it's not like the Dark Blade. It's kind of different, right? The Dark Blade V3 is also super hard to get. But in today's video, we're gonna be mastering the Cursed Duo Katana. This sword is made out of the Yama and the Tushira sword. Two very cursed swords in block shoots and you also will need them to even get the Cursed Duo Katana. And this will make me officially the strongest person alive. Well, kind of. Now, first thing first, maybe you guys already know this, but I actually do already have the Tushira sword all the way up to mastery 350, alright? And I kinda don't know why I have this. I did it a long time ago, but you also will need 350 mastery on both swords, Yama and Tushida, to even start this puzzle. And now we also have the Yama sword right here, and it also has above 350 mastery, so we're pretty much ready to do the puzzle of the Cursed Duo Katana. Now this puzzle can take hours upon hours, this, this can literally take days, but I'm gonna be attempting to do it within one try, literally like in one go. Wish me luck. And obviously guys, this is one of the five mythical swords in block shoots, and it's the only one that has a puzzle to obtain it. And we're gonna get started with the puzzle. Also, before I forget you have to be level 2200 to even start this quest now luckily i'm max level so that's gonna be no problem and also if you guys don't know how to get yama in order to obtain yama you have to talk to this guy over here the elite hunter this guy will send you up to kill 30 elite pirates and if i click on progress as you can see i have 60 of them defeated and i'm pretty sure you only need 30 of them to unlock the yama sword after you defeated all these elite pirates you have to go to the secret waterfall in hydra island and go through the secret door which is right over here and there will be a lot of ghosts over here they're trying to kill you. As you can see, the Yama sword is right there in a stone. You just have to pull it out after you kill all these ghosts. Hey, don't kill me now. What the heck? Get out of here. Wait, the door is locked. What the heck? Wait, get me out of here. Now, for the Tushida sword, you have to go over and summon Rip Indra. While you summon Rip Indra right here with a god chalice, you have to be quick. And you have to go back to the same secret entrance you got the Yama with. But this time, there's another secret passage that opens. And let's get all these ghosts out of here. And then when you go all the way up right here, let's see. Is this open? Come on. Oh, I don't think it's open. Oh, it's open. Okay. Now you're in a secret cave and then this door will be open if Rip Indra is spawned. And once you go through that, you have to light some torches at Turtle Island. And that's how you get to Shira. So yeah, it's kind of hard. Now, after you've done all of that, you have to master both of these swords to 350 mastery. And then you can start getting the Curse Duel. And of course, we got Star Veer, okay? And uh, uh, I already see that, man. I already see that. You got a Curse Duel. All right, buddy. I'm going to be getting that as well, okay? I'm going to become even more OP. Even though I only have one sword right now which is pretty much the same sword look at that it, one of them is yama i don't know if you can see that but yeah right here you can see that yama and tushida both together forms the curse duo but now i'm gonna start a quest and i'm actually gonna get it you are never going to get it haha <laughs> bro what i'm gonna i'm gonna get it what what are you talking about i literally got every single sword so far like every mythic hollow sight true triple like you don't even have hollow sight like what are you even talking about you're just talking crap right but now come here and roll fruit okay because we still didn't roll fruit okay so let's go roll fruit let's see if luck is with us, I can actually go ahead and get this sword, okay? Please! Oh my- oh no, no, no! All right, uh, I might not even get this sword today. This is bad. All right, but now to start this quest, we're pretty much at a location, okay? We have to go to this tower behind the mansion. And I'm pretty sure on the left side, we will find an NPC. Oh, there he is. The Crypt Master. What is he about to say? Have you seen the entrance behind this building? It feels cursed. No, I haven't. I think you can handle it. I can open the way for you if you want. Uh, okay. It should be open now. Good luck in there. Um, all right. Thanks, I guess. At the back of this thing, where is this? Th oh, I see the- Oh my- God. Okay, um, let's go in, okay? Let's see. Oh, what is this place? Why is it filled with skeletons and some curse-like drawings? What is that? Oh, wait a minute. I see a scroll right here, and I see a scroll right here, and I can interact with it. All right, here we go, I guess. Oh, the Yama scroll. Pain and suffering, haze of misery, and fear the reaper. Cursed trial. Pain and suffering. Um, now what? How do I even know? Wait, wait a minute. Did these lanterns just turn red? Why are these? Oh, oh, this is the angel side, and this is the evil side. It feels like a spirit food room, to be honest. Now, apparently, we have to have the Yama sword 
equipped for this and die to an NPC? Like, what? I guess that's why it's called the Haze of Misery. So, uh, mythological pirates, you know, you can just hit me. Apparently, we just gotta get hits until we get some kind of fragment. For sure, it's called the Alucard Fragment. It's like a red shard. Now, I'm not getting anything so far. Do I have to, <gasps> die? Have to die? Wait, maybe I have to hold the Yama Sword. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Obtained the Alucard Fragment. The scroll reacts to your achievements. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Do I have to go back now? What the heck is this thing? I guess one quest already completed and five more to go. All right, we're back at the scroll. Let's see. Interact. Okay, so we just done Pain and Suffering. Now, time to do Haze of Misery. Okay, second trial. Haze of Misery. Okay, what? Oh, why is everything foggy? What the heck? Wait, everything is foggy now. What the heck? What happens? Now, guys, I'm on the wiki and it says the player vision will fog and a purple marking will appear on a group of NPCs. The player will have to kill the group that has currently the marking. Interesting. So, we have to find groups with purple markings. Once killed, the marking will be switched to that different one and the player will have to kill these instead. This continues for a while and can take long until the fog stops. Wait, what? So, we have to find purple NPCs or something? Are these? Oh, these have purple markings. What the heck? Come here, buddy. I need to kill you. Wait, and this guy doesn't? Wait. Uh, wait, this guy doesn't. Wait, what? Do I still have to kill this guy, though? Um, I have no clue. One of them had it. I'm not completely sure. Does this guy have it? This guy also doesn't have it. Wait, what? Was it just one NPC? All right, let's see. Oh, I see some purple markings. There you go. So, all of them have the purple markings. So, I guess I have to kill all of them and then go on to the next group, okay? So, come here, buddy. Give me your purple marking, okay? It's like a purple thing and when I kill them, it disappears? Um, wait, why does it disappear? Do I have to still kill all of them? This is so weird and so confusing. All right, that should be all of them. There you go. Everyone is dead. Okay, where are the pineapples? And these NPCs have it as well. What? Does just every NPC have it? I, I mean, I guess so. Easier for me. Okay, and these NPCs don't have a purple thing. Okay, so I don't kill these, I guess. Oh, and the fishmen have it also. Okay, so let's kill the fishmen. And that should be it for Turtle Island, maybe? I have no clue. I'm just killing all of them. There you go. I found some more at Hydra Island. Not all of the NPCs have the purple markings. Like, I have to find them, which is kind of annoying. I guess that's gonna slash them up real quick. And not every single one of them has them. Come here, buddy. Take some of this. There you go. And stop hiding, you stupid, okay? Let's get that one. This guy also has purple. Die. Every purple guy has to die. Die, okay? There you go. Take some of this. And take some of this, okay? You're dead. Okay, this one doesn't have it. And this one also doesn't have it. This is so weird. Now, where do I go next? To these? Let's see. Do oh, these have it as well. Okay, die. Come on, there you go. You're dead. Okay, these one have it as well. Come on. Now you have to die as well. I'm about to hire bounty hunters to literally hunt them down, okay? Everyone with purple markings have to die. Take this and take this. You're dead. Oh, and these ghosts have it as well. What the heck? I did not expect that. I'm glad I checked her, okay? Come on, you go ahead and die real quick. Die. And these were all of them. Okay, one more. There you go. And that's all. Let's get out of here. Where's the next group? You all are going to die. Okay, I'm at Haunted and all of the skeletons at Haunted have it. Okay, okay. So I just gotta kill all of them. Buddha transform and come here, buddy. Let's lure all of them together and let's just uh, slaughter them, you know? And there you go. Everybody is dead. Okay, perfect. Wait, come on. Can I pray? Come on. Oh, uh, nothing. Unlucky. Let's see. Do these have it? Okay, these don't have the purple markings. What the heck? And then these maybe? These also don't have it. Maybe downstairs? Okay, the downstairs ones have it. The possessed mummies. You're all going to die. You're already a mummy, but you're gonna die again, okay? Some of this, buddy. Yeah, take some of the god human, okay? Oh, I can even see through the walls who have the purple markings. Look at that. The living zombies, all of them have it. And look what we got here. The living zombies, all with a purple marking. You already know what's gonna happen to you, okay? Everyone is gonna die, okay? You're gonna die, you're gonna die, and you're gonna die. Just like that. And everybody's dead. Now, on to the next one. At the grade three, and everybody has a purple marking, okay? Perfect. And it's still so foggy, bro. The fog is making me crazy, bro. Get the fog out of here. I don't want it to be foggy anymore, man. Come on, die. So the fog can disappear, please. Oh, there you go. All card fragment. Okay, we've gotten all of them. There we go, finally. Oh my god, that took a while. And I didn't even go through all of the islands, so that's kind of weird. But I will take that, all right? All right, let's go back to this cursed place. Let's see what is next. Okay, let's see Yama Scroll. Okay, the next one is Fear the Reaper. Third trial. Now, what do we do? Wait, how does anyone figure this out on his own? Like, how do you know what Fear the Reaper is? Like, what? How do you do this without an explanation? Like, bro, there's no way someone did this without explanation. Like, I don't believe it. But apparently, Apparently, we have to spawn in a soul reaper and then get killed by it and then we get teleported into a place called hell like bro what yeah this is getting more interesting and more interesting but we have to go to this death king npc to roll some spins okay because this guy will give us a hollow essence to spawn the boss in and look at that 
first try. This was my first roll. I, what? Um, I, I'll take that, I, I guess. Yeah, I've been saving up bones for this. Like, don't get me wrong. Look at this. 4,000 bones. Because I knew this was going to take a while. But I guess I got lucky. Dude, I've never gotten this lucky before. I'll take it. Wait, wait. I don't even know what I'm doing. Let's go back and spawn the boss. Okay, there you go. Spawn it in. An unknown being has entered this world. And now let's go die to the boss. Yeah, for the first time, I'm not going to kill you, okay? You can kill me, okay? Yeah. Just slash me up, all right? Yeah. Just, just do it, okay? I'll accept my fate, okay? I'll accept it. Loading. What the heck happened? And now he's... Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, what is this? Hell dimension? Bro, uh, where am I? Why can't I see a single thing? Like, why is it so dark? Uh, and now I have to find torches, it seems like. Light torch? Let's see. What does this do? Oh. Oh, buddy. Okay. Okay, chill. What did I do? Did I... I just light a torch. Are you after me? Okay, I guess if you're after me, I have no choice but to defeat you, okay? Come here, buddy. You are nothing, okay? You are literally nothing. I'm gonna slash you up like that. There you go. And you you're dead, okay? Um, yeah, that wasn't even a challenge. Where's the next one? Okay, wait. Oh, these are hidden in, like, the rocks. Like, they're camouflaged, and it's so dark, so I can barely see that, okay? Let's light them as well. Okay, now you didn't get me. I'm fully alert, okay? I'm gonna be slashing you up, and I'm gonna be getting the cursed duo katana, okay? People are doubting me, but I'm gonna get it, okay? Now you're all gonna be dead like that, and where's the last one? Because I really can't find it. Maybe right behind here? No. Wait, does this lava damage me? Okay, this lava luckily doesn't damage me. Wait, where's this last one? I can't find it. Um, guys, Guys, how do you find the last one? Where, where is it? No, no, I actually can't find it. What, where's, where the heck is this thing? Um, oh, I find it. What the heck? Okay, this one was crazy. I couldn't find this one, okay? Spawn it in. Okay, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh, I almost died. Just because they caught me off guard, okay? But now you're all gonna die, okay? Now you're all gonna die, okay? Let me heal up. Let me do that. And you're all gonna be dead, alright? Wait, there's one tanky one? What the heck is that? Wait, who is this guy? Um, apparently this guy has Dark Blade V2. Okay, I gotta be careful. I gotta be careful, okay? Let me slash this guy out like that. Come on. V4 transform. Yeah, but you're gonna have it easy, okay? Take some of this and take some of that. And now literally die. Just like that, okay? You're dead. And now oh, the portal has opened. And now we just gotta go through this portal and let's see. Oh, there you go. Alucard fragment has been obtained. The scroll reacts to your achievements. And that is the third fragment. Now let's go back to the scroll because what's gonna happen now? Interact, let's see. The scroll bursts into flames and disappears. Wait, it disappeared. What? Uh, is that supposed to happen? Um, Please tell me so, okay? There you go. And now we have another scroll, which is the two sheets. Cheetah scroll, right? Yeah. Dark Legend, Sense of Duty, and Soulless. All right, let's go and start this one as well. First trial. Dark Legend? What is that supposed to mean? All right, Dark Legend is talk to three different boat dealers in three different islands and select Pardon Me. And on the last page of the boats. Oh, easy. Don't have to ask me twice. And I'm pretty sure there's one on the turtle entrance, okay? Am I right? Yes, there's a boat dealer over here. Okay, let's see. Is it this one? Let's see. Next. Next. Oh, pardon me. Okay, let's see. Boom. Hey, traveler, I recognize you. It's pleasant to see a familiar face around here. Yeah, hey, what's up, buddy? Okay, that was one. Now, maybe Cakeland has one? I'm pretty sure it does, right? Yeah, there you go. Next, next, next. And there you go. Pardon me, okay? Let's see. Another one. All right, there you go. That's two. Let's see. Let's go portal now. That's the block tree dealer. Now, here's the luxury boat dealer. Next, next, and pardon me. And boom. All the card fragment update. Wait, bro. Curse duel is easy so far. I already have four fragments. Is this a joke to you guys? <laughs> like, what? So far, I'm getting the curse duel within five minutes, okay? So, watch me, all right? Alright, right, next trial, come at me, bro. Okay, second trial, there you go. Sense of duty, bro. How does anyone figure this out without an explanation? Like, sense of duty? What does that even mean? Maybe Dark Legend, I would understand. What is sense of duty? Oh, apparently it's kill a pirate in a pirate raid in the castle on the sea. Oh, well, I mean, how do I even spawn a pirate raid? I, I can't. I, I literally can't. So now I just gotta wait until a pirate raid comes and I can actually defeat it. Oh, man. I guess this is the hardest one so far, just waiting for a pirate raid raid. What? Okay, not really. The purple ones were a little harder because of the fog, okay? But now, I guess we just wait. Oh, and guys, while waiting, I just realized, look at this. Alucard Fragment. It's kind of like the Dark Fragment and Mirror Fractal, but it's a, like a red shard and I have four of them. So, two more to go and I have enough for the Cursed Duo Katana. Not too bad. Now, this is one of my biggest videos so far. So, if you guys want any of these perm fruits on the screen, make sure you like the video, subscribe, and let me know which one is your favorite. I'm gonna choose one winner for this video. Now, I'm gonna be, um, waiting, I guess. Oh, a block tree has spawned in the game. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, guys, I'm waiting and I literally noticed that. Okay, yes, yes, okay. Where is this thing? I'm pretty sure it's Sport Town. Um, it is. Okay. Please be a mythical fruit. I haven't found a mythical fruit in ages, okay? Please. Oh. Uh what? I literally rolled a chop fruit in the beginning of the video. Bro, I am cursed. Throw this in the ocean. I don't want to see this fruit anymore. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. Throw it. Throw it. 
Get away! I hope it never comes back, bro. Oh, the pirates have been spotted approaching the castle. Okay, it's finally time. It's finally time. One of the last quests to unlocking the best sword in the entire game. Okay, they're raiding the castle now. Let's see. Come on. Okay, how many do I have to kill? Do I have just to kill one? Just like that? Okay, no, definitely not. I probably have to kill the last pirate. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's the guy. All right, come here, buddy. Take some of my god human. Just like that. Just like this. And you're gonna be dead. Three, two, one. Boom. Let's see. Oh, there you go. Alucard fragment obtained. And we got a ki kilo fruit. Okay, yeah, that's that's cool, man. That's cool. What is this curse? Get me out of here. Right, now we're going back to the secret place. Just to finish this quest off, right? All right, let's see. Interact. And the last one is soulless. So let's see. Third trial, soulless. All right, there you go. Now that's going to be the last one. So we can obtain six Alucard fragments to obtain the curse duo. Okay, I, I, I don't see a curse duo around here, but let's go and do this last quest. Dang, apparently for this one, we have to kill K-Queen in under two minutes. And after we punch K-Queen for the first time, a song is gonna play. And then we'll have two minutes to defeat her. Oh, what's the best sword to do it with? Okay, let's see. I'm pretty sure my Dark Blade has insane damage. All right, so I'm equipping Dark Blade, Pal Scarf, let's see. All right, K-Queen, you're dead, okay? Okay, let's get started. Oh, I heard the song. I heard the song. Okay, come on. We have to be fast. We have to be fast, okay? Wait, I don't have points on sword. I don't have points on sword. Oh my, I just realized. I just realized I don't have points on sword. Oh my. No, this is so stupid. This is so stupid. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna get it. No. I forgot. Oh my god, look at the fighting style glitch. What the heck? I have like crazy aura. Oh my god, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Probably like one more minute. Come on, we have to do this. We have to do this. Come on, come on, come on. All right, she's getting low. She's getting low. K Queen, come on. Don't hit me. Don't hit me. No. How does she hit me? Come on. Please, faster. Come on, no. Are we gonna be on time? I don't know. I don't know. Come on. No, why do you dog back me so much? Come on, please. 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 Come on. Am I on time? I still heard the song. I still heard the song. Oh. Did we do it? Oh, loading. Okay, okay, okay. What is this heavenly dimension? Wait, so first we were in hell and now we're in heaven. Oh my god. So this is what heaven looks like? Amazing. Okay, where's the torches? Okay, so we have to find torches again. Uh, I don't see any. Oh, I found one. Okay, there we go. Light torch. And now dash back. Okay, yeah, I already know what's going on here. You guys trying to ambush me, right? Well, there's no problem for me, okay? Let me dash you and slash you up. Ha, <laughs> rookie skeletons, right? And now we have to fight two more torches. Okay, where do we find these? And maybe somewhere around here. They're usually on like rocks, right? I don't see. Maybe in the plant here. I don't I don't see anything over here. Let's see. Oh, I found another one. Okay, there you go. Light the torch. Dash back. Yeah, I already know what you guys are planning. We're about to unlock the curse duo. Okay, come on, come on. This is gonna be the last. Okay, there you go. All of them are dead. And now the last torch is hey, right over here. I found it. I'll light it up and oh, uh, what the heck? Is there like a light boss or oh, there's a boss. What the heck? Okay, let's get everyone. How does this boss look like? Let's see. Oh, what is that? Does he have angel v4? Oh, he doesn't even have angel, does he? Wait, what? What are these wings? Angel v5? Oh, I'm getting smashed. I'm getting smashed. Okay, wait. Angel, I'm sorry, buddy, but you're gonna die, okay? You're gonna die. Bro, he's doing no damage. Bro, he's doing moves, but he's doing absolutely no damage, bruh. Is this really what Curse Duel is? Like, these bosses are not even doing damage. You made me slash you, dash you up. Ugh, come on. There you go. Die, and he's about to die. It looks pretty good, though, you know, with the angel thing, with the flight. Okay, anyway. Hey. Oh. Why did it look like I died? <gasps> what? Okay, that was really weird, but the heavenly portal opens, and we're going to heaven. Finally, and there you go, obtained Alucard Fragment. That is gonna be the last one. And now, what do we do now? Let's see, talk to the scroll. Oh, it disappears, okay. It bursts into flames and disappears. And now what? Wait, do I have to go to this thing? Oh, oh, there's a pedestal. Okay, interact. Question mark, question mark, question mark. The six shards of the legendary Alucard. Oh, Fragment react to the each other. Oh, what is happening? Uh, the door is opening. What is this? Oh, oh, oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm locked, I'm locked. I'm locked with this cursed skeleton boss. What is this guy doing? Oh, it looks like he has the cursed duo. So I guess we have to beat this guy to get the cursed duo. Hey, bad. Say no more. <gasps> oh, wait, he's immune? Um, wait, let me try again. Wait, I can't hit him? What the heck? I definitely have my aura activated. Why can I hit this guy? Activate your aura ability to deal damage. Bro, I have it activated. Uh, is this bugged, guys? I don't even understand what's happening. Why can I hit this guy? Oh. What? Uh, I've officially bugged the game. I don't know what's going on. Come on. Maybe even Buddha transformation. Let's see. I still can't hit this guy. Um, guys. Maybe if I turn my hockey off. Let's see. Can I hit this guy now? I still can't hit this guy. Um, what? Why can't I hit it? Okay, guys. It's bugged. It's bu it literally bugged. Do I have to just die to this guy? Like, all this work for nothing? All this work to just die and not get a curse duo? What? No, no. But, like, seriously. I, I can't hit him. I, I, like, literally can't hit him. I, I guess we die? Like... What? I, I I guess we we die. Wait, but can I even still get it? No, 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 don't tell me, don't tell me. Come on, get up, get up, get up, quick, quick, quick. Let's see, come on. Oh, can we just refight him? Oh, we can. Okay, perfect. Now hockey enable, and let's see. Oh, 
Uh, I, I still can't damage him. I, I still can't damage him. Uh, I guess let's die again. Uh, I mean, I, I literally can't damage him. Like, oh, guys. Oh, oh, oh. I did not read one thing, okay? But who, who knows this? Who knows this? You have to kill the boss with Tushita or Yama. Otherwise, it takes no damage. But why does it say that I need hockey on? Like, it doesn't make sense. Anyway, let's go and spawn it in once again. Open the door. And it's open. And now I can damage him. Let's see. Oh. Now I can damage him. But it doesn't say. Like, look, if you hit him, it just says it's immune to physical attacks, which is not the case. So, in my opinion, this should be changed. Like, the error message. Because it's not clear what you're doing wrong. But anyway, I guess I found out what's going on. And now I just gotta slash him and dash him. And then we're getting the curse duo. Come on. All right, come here, buddy. You are nothing, okay? This Sushida sword is gonna slash you, dash you. Take some of this. There you go. And the skeleton is gonna be dead within a second, all right? This is one of the strongest bosses, I guess, because this has the curse duel. I'm gonna take that curse duel, and it's gonna be mine. So die, and he's... Oh, look at my sword. What the heck just happened to... Oh, oh my god. Obtained the cursed duel katana. Oh my god. And what is this cursed skeleton doing over here? What do you think you are, buddy? Oh, I'm fighting with a cursed duel. Oh my god. Yo! Yo, what are these cursed skeletons doing here? Oh my god. Yo, chill. Chill, buddy. I'm gonna slash you guys all up, all right? Yeah, take some- Oh, you're tanky. Why are they so tanky? Uh, guys, I have a problem over here. Wait, can he- Can he even hit me? Oh, oh, they can, they can, they can, they can. Chill, 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 chill. Wait, wait, wait. Go V4? Come on. Can I even defeat these guys? Like, what? Everybody, die. Wait, I'm not getting any mastery by this. What? Wait. They're infinitely spawning. I need to get away. I need to get away. Yo, yo, yo. Get me out of here. They're infinitely spawning. All right, there you go. Oh my god. Look at that. The cursed dual katana. I unlocked it. Oh my god. After so long. Okay, let, look at that. Cursed dual katana. Wait a minute. Why is it not next to my mythical swords? Ah, I have to upgrade his sword. Yes, that's what we also gotta do. And oh, oh, look at this. Look at the aura. I feel so powerful already. But we will have to unlock both abilities, okay? Revolver Ravager and Slayer of Goliath, which is the 375. That is so much mastery. Oh my god, that's gonna take so long again. And look who is here. Look, look at my swords, buddy. I got the curse too, okay? You were doubting me. You were doubting me, okay? You said I wasn't capable of getting it. How? Well, easy job, bro. I, I got it in like two hours or something. So fast? Yeah, right? I got it in like less than two hours. It was crazy. I got a hollow essence first try. That's right. Oh, yeah, that's right, buddy. Uh, but anyway, Way, we have to master this sword, all right, and check the damage. Oh, you already probably know the damage, but I don't know the damage. Oh, oh look at these slashes. They look sick. You need to buy a lottery ticket. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> you're right, to be honest. Getting Hollow Essence first try is crazy luck. But let me roll through real quick, because I can probably roll one already, okay? It's been a while, okay? It's been a minute. Let's see. Can I roll fruits? And I can, and, and, uh... Uh, uh, here, take that, take that, take that. I don't want that! That's the second kilo food I got today, bro. I swear, if you got a kilo food as well... Oh! No, 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 drop it. Oh, oh, you drop... Hey, yo! Get a Buddha fruit, yo! Oh my god, look at that. No Buddha fruit, bro. That is insane. Anyway, let's go ahead and check the damage. Because I'm excited, right? This is supposed to be the best sword in the entire game. I cannot store it. You have it. Um, yeah, sure, I have enough storage. I can I can store it. Why not, man? Here, store that real quick. There you go. Don't mind if I do. But let me equip Pal Scarf and let's check the damage, right? Three, two, one, and go. 2.7, ooh, 2.6k with a level 1 mastery. That is some pretty good damage, I'm not gonna lie. But I wanna have more damage, right? So Blacksmith upgrade the best sword of the game. How much is this gonna cost? Oh, uh, 6, okay, enough. And I need 4 of these too. What are these two? Like, um, how do I get these? And it only gives me a 7% damage increase? That is very little. But we have to get it, alright? Now, where do I even get teeth? Like, um, what? But these mythological pirates give the teeth. I have to fight these. Let's see. Wait, 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 wait. I need to try it. How does Curse Duel look with the Buddha glitch? Let's see. Oh my god. No. The Curse Swords with the Buddha glitch. This looks insane. Yo, this is the sickest it will look, okay? Oh my god. Okay, let's slash him up and we can also get some mastery. Okay, okay. But the main objective is these teeth, all right? So give me that, give me that. For sure there's more over here. There you go. Dude, I feel so powerful. Oh, and we got a new skill available. Wait. Oh, we already got enough? By just killing these, like, I'm trying to get these teeth. These materials. I, I guess I can get that. Let's go use the ability. Let's see what the damage is like okay let's see three two one and oh my god oh my show 5.7k damage 5.7 thousand damage and that was revolving ravager oh my god tap it wait tap it oh like what okay let's see i, I hold it in yeah okay let's see tap it that was kind of the same 
thing, but then less damage, I guess. Only if I, like, do it next to you like that, you get damage, you see? But other than that, it's pretty much the same thing. Okay, that damage is insane, though. I cannot wait for Slayer of Galia to unlock the full potential and upgrade the sword to max level. First, I need the materials to upgrade the sword, okay? So, pirates, give me some materials, all right? Stop stalling already. All right, and there you go. Obtain mini tusk. That's the last one. All right, so now we can go back and upgrade the sword. And uh, where is Star, dude? What the heck did you just get? Is that a new fighting style? What the heck? Oh my god. That looks insane. Zeus race V4? Bro, bro, what? That's not Zeus. What? All right, anyway, let's go on and go over here to Port Town because we need to upgrade our curse door, all right? There's no time for stalling. Let's go to the blacksmith and let's upgrade the sword for max potential. Look at that. We got that. We got that. We got that. Craft. All right, there you go. We just upgraded it. Oh my god. And now it should be next to my other mythical swords. Let's see. Yeah, look at that. These are all in a row. That looks so nice. Now, let's see how much damage it does. All right, let's see. Let's see. One slash did 2.6k. Now, it does... 3k? Yo, it's already getting super high, even though we still need to master this up, alright? So, uh, I also want to try this ability once again. Let's see. What if I just use it right here? Come on. How much damage? 6.2k. What? Half of your HP is gone by one attack? Like, what? But I'm curious. Do you get stunned? Yes? Wait, really? So, if I use it, you, you have no... Oh, I can't escape. Oh my, yo, that is insane. All right, so now I gotta get 375 mastery, which that's a lot, all right? How do people even get that on the sword? I mean, this sword is insane, though. Let's go and teleport to turtle entrance, because we need to fight somebody. And I'm gonna be speeding this up, because this is gonna take a while. All right, what's good, Longma? This is one of my new swords, okay? You're about to die, okay? You're Okay, look at that. Look at that damage. Look at that damage, all right? That's not gonna help much, because you're already dead. Now we go to Big Mom to do it all over again, until we get 375 mastery. All right, kick is all the way low. Low, and uh, she's dead. Alright. And Longma, go ahead and die again. Just like that. And now we go back to Big Mom. And K-Queen, let me slash up like that. Look at that combo. Oh my god. 200k da 250k damage. Oh my god, bro. And go ahead and die. Alright, so we got up to 350 mastery. Like, 20 more to go for the ability. 366 mastery. That means 9 more mastery. And Longma, you're about to die, buddy. You're about to die, buddy. Yeah. Take my curse duel. Got Tanas, alright? Take some of this. There you go. And let me slash up like that. Okay. 5 more mastery to go. And we'll finally have it, right? The maxed out Curse Duo Katana. So, K-Queen, you're the last person that can actually give me this mastery. So, come here, K-Queen. Come on. Let me slash you up with the Curse Duo. This sword is the best. I'm telling you guys, this is... There's no better sword than this. Like, bro, what other sword can do this? Super fast slashing with high damage. Plus, your ability is, like, stun the enemy and do crazy damage. And I still haven't unlocked the last one, okay? Imagine. And now, we're about to unlock it. Come on. Come on. Let's go. New skill available. We just unlocked Slayer of Goal yet. Oh my god, okay, I need to try this. Where's Star at? All right, here we are. Star, are you ready? I have mastered the Curse Duo Katana. Up to 375, and now I can use this ability, okay? So, uh, let's see it, all right? Three, two, one, and... Oh my god. And now, I slash. Oh my... Wait, why am I all the way here? Uh, what was that? Let's see. Oh... Yo, what? Why was there a chain on my screen? What the heck? Wait, what if I tap it? What if I tap it? Let's see. Oh, okay, okay. That is such a quick ability and it does 5k damage. Not too bad. So imagine from here, like from far range like that, I charge up and I... Oh, this has crazy range. 6k damage? Okay, that's insane. Okay, yeah, this is super high damage and why does one of my swords... Not have the, uh, the aura? What? what? These swords look insane. Look at the red aura. This is one of the best looking swords ever. I mean, maybe the dark blade is competing, but still. I want to see how much this ability does. Let's see. Let's see. How much does it do? After having all this mastery, 6.5 thousand. Okay, yeah, this is the highest damage ever. For a sword, that is insane. You have fast and one clicks, you have high damage, and you have a crazy bounty hunting ability, okay? The X one, you can go really far with this. And nobody will expect it. So I guess that was the Kurzu Katana puzzle. This is the best sword inside of the game. Maybe it's gonna change soon, okay? Who knows? Subscribe.